even and odd numbers. Even and odd three-digit numbers. Let us first begin with three-digit even numbers. The same rule is applied to find out whether a number of a three-digit is even or odd. You only have to check the units place of the given number. If the units place of a given three-digit number contains 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8, then it is an even number. Let us see some even three-digit numbers. For example, 300, 482, 934, 706, 598. Here, the digit in the unit's place of the number 300 is 0. Hence, 300 is an even number. The digit in the unit's place of the number 482 is 2. Hence, 482 is an even number. The digit in the unit's place of the number 984 is 4. Hence, 984 is an even number. The digit in the unit's place of the number 706 is 6. Hence, 706 is an even number. The digit in the unit's place of the number 598 is 8. Hence, 598 is an even number. Children, isn't this very simple? Now, let us see three-digit odd numbers. Again here, you only have to check the units place of the given number. If the units place of a given three-digit number contains 1, 3, 5, 7, or 9, then it is an odd number. Let us see some odd three-digit numbers. For example, 293, 109, 875, 211, 487. As the digit in the units place of the number 293 is 3, 293 is an odd number. As the digit in the units place of the number 109 is 9, 109 is an odd number. As the digit in the units place of the number 875 is 5, 875 is an odd number. As the digit in the units place of the number 211 is 1, 211 is an odd number. As the digit in the units place of the number 487 is 7, 487 is an odd number. Wasn't this as simple as even numbers? Now it is time for an activity. Group the following numbers as odd and even numbers. 345, 298, 710, 309, 283, 241, 592, 444, 716, 927. We know that if the digit in the units place of the number is 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8, then the number is an even number. And if the digit in the units place of the number is 1, 3, 5, 7 or 9, then the number is an odd number. So let us begin with the grouping. For grouping, 
we will first make two columns, even numbers and odd numbers. Now we will write an even number in the even number column and an odd number in an odd number column. So, let us begin with the first number. As the digit in the units place of the number 345 is 5, 345 is an odd number and should be written in an odd number column. As the digit in the units place of the number 298 is 8, 298 is an even number and should be written in an even number column. In the same manner, we will group the other numbers. 710 is an even number. 309 is an odd number. 283 is an odd number. 241 is an odd number. 592 is an even number. 444 is an even number. 716 is an even number. 927 is an odd number. Now, let us do exercise from page number 20. Question 1. Circle the even numbers. 457 777, 670, 381, 869, 863, 892, 298, 754. As the digit in the units place of the number 670, 892, 298 and 754 are even, these numbers are also even. Therefore, 670, 892, 298 and 754 are even numbers. Question 2. Circle the odd numbers. 745, 887, 660, 183, 589, 386, 296, 574, 407. As the digit in the units place of the number 745, 887, 183, 589 and 407 are odd, these numbers are also odd. Therefore, 745, 887, 183, 589, 407 are odd numbers. Question 3. Make two three-digit odd numbers using the given digits. The given digits are 5, 4 and 8. As here you can see that among the digits given, only 5 is an odd number. We will make such three-digit numbers in which the digit in the units place should be 5. Then only the number made will be an odd number. So, let us write 5 in the units place first. Now, the other two numbers given are 4 and 8, which you can write anywhere, either in the hundreds place or in the units place simultaneously. Therefore, the two three-digit Odd numbers formed are 485 and 845. 
Question 4. Make two three-digit even numbers using the given digits. The given digits are 4, 0 and 7. As here you can see that among the digits given, 4 and 0 are an even number. We will make such three-digit numbers in which the digit in the unit's place should be either 4 or 0. And then only the number made will be an even number. So let us write 0 in the unit's place first. Now the other two numbers given are 4 and 7, which you can write anywhere, either in the hundreds place or in the units place, as explained earlier. Therefore, the two three-digit even numbers formed are 470 and 740. Similarly, we can also make three-digit even numbers by writing 4 in the units place. Now, as the other two numbers given are 0 and 7, you can write anywhere, either in the hundreds place or in the units place as done earlier. Thus, the two numbers formed by keeping 4 in the units place are 0, 7, 4 and 704. Note that 074 is read as only 74. Thus, it is not a three-digit even number. It is a two-digit even number. So, there is only one three-digit even number formed by keeping four in the units place and that is the number 704. You can write any of the two numbers as your answer from 470, 740 and 704.